Good evening, I'm Allison Henning. Thanks so much for joining us. Tonight, one person is dead and several others injured after a neighborhood boxing match in St. Petersburg. It happened behind the Skyway Shopping Plaza on 67th Avenue South. And on your side's Olivia Steen joined us live now from the scene. Olivia. This is where hundreds of people gathered for that boxing match. As you can see, the ring, it's a legitimate ring. It's still set up and it's right behind the Skyway Plaza. St. Pete police blocked off the Skyway Plaza for several hours on Saturday night, trying to piece together what happened at this community boxing match. You know, we still have to do some homework and find out uh, how the, the boxing match was put on, what kind of permits they had, the promoter, etc. It's really too early to tell. We're more concerned with the shooting investigation at this time and the victims that we have. St. Pete police say a fight broke out between two groups and 21-year-old Trevon Barton was shot and killed. Four other people were sent to the local hospital for injuries. So far, police tell me they've arrested one person, this man, 21-year-old Robert Cooley. At this point, we know several shots were fired by the boxing ring, but here in the front, there were also shots fired. At least one car was hit. Unfortunately, this event added to St. Pete's climbing number of homicides so far this year. We're told the city has already surpassed last year's statistic. And now we also received a statement from the organizer of the event who says that the shooting actually happened when the event was over. And he says this boxing match was actually a part of an effort, a city effort, to stop gun violence here in St. Pete. And we'll hear more from him tonight at 11. Live in St. Petersburg, Olivia Steen, 8 on your side. Tonight